very easy. That's why you write reimbursement in there so it can be tracked and you know exactly what took place. And it, you know, everything can be proven. So you can see right here what took place. Zero. I canceled this. So after this, at, when this happened, you know, I, when I accidentally just, you know, took $600 out of my account, I about crap myself, so I pulled, I, I, you know, I, the way that I canceled it was I called in. And when I called in, I hit back, so I'm going to go back to my account again my orders just so brother Elliot's coming in just to make sure everybody can see everything you'll notice this looks exactly the same as before last nine months again okay I called in and I spoke to a lady and I explained to her specifically what I wanted to do here and now this is going to get, you know, uh, this is where it's going to start making a lot more sense. If you'll notice, the total amount up here says $599.18 as if everything was paid for, right? But then it tells you that it's partially shipped, okay? Well, I'm going to go into why right now. If you go into the order details right here, I'll be able to explain that. So I called in and I explained to the woman what I wanted to do. I was purchasing the printer, of course, from Faith Forward Baptist Church because Pastor Anderson had authorized that. They said that he said that he would pay for the microphone and the printer specifically in a conversation and he always told me that they would pay for everything. And he said that, and he even told me multiple times that they want to do this for every guy that they send out from now on. Now, if you say, oh man, this is super expensive. Why are you just buying a printer like this on the church's dime? Well, number one, let me tell you that, that if you notice that, I was being frugal with the money. I picked a printer that was $500 off. How often can you find a deal like that? Yeah, I'm just trying to buy the, you know, the best printer that they had. $500 half off when it's $1,000. The, the church, and, you, and here's the thing, when you're printing tons of bulletins, when you're printing tons of soul winning maps, maps, when you're just printing tons of material constantly, and I was going to start off working for the church, hey, this is another thing I wanted to bring up too, I almost forgot about. Another thing is, you'll notice I have a Mac right here. Well, I bought this, this Mac, because this is the exact type of computer, like exactly the same, the same amount of memory, everything, as the computer that I, I used at the church. And I like the computer that I used at the church a lot. Now, I never used Mac until I was always using Windows my whole life until I started working at Faith Four Baptist Church and Pastor Anderson used Mac and I realized that I like Mac better. You know, that may offend a lot of people, but I, I then liked Apple much better. I think it's more user friendly. 
And um, so I went out and I bought this for a personal computer because we had a laptop that died, so I, we needed a computer at home. And I I bought this, and uh, but the but let me tell you this: this is what I'm getting into. This exact computer that I have was uh, the same type of computer that I used at work. Another thing that Pastor Anderson was gonna do was he was he told me literally like the week before I left that he was going to allow me to take my work computer with me. That he was going to allow me to take the work computer that I had been using the whole time and he was just going to buy a fresh new